it was a little heartbreaking um, and it made me kind of like it was like a missing a piece of my neighborhood that I wasn't sure if I'm ever going to get back again. Yeah, this was a big one for folks who live in this area. Five years ago today, that massive fire you see there gutted a grocery store in North Phoenix, covering neighboring homes in ash. Yeah, monsoon storm damage caused a roof collapse, which ruptured a gas line, and it sparked this massive fire. The Safeway store over at 35th Avenue in Northern had been a gathering place for the community for decades. Many in the neighborhood relied on the convenience of having it so close. So as I mentioned, the monsoon basically dumped a lot of rain on the roof. The weight caused a collapse, which took down a gas line and things just got worse from there. There was the fire. Even with a huge response from firefighters, the store could not be saved. And a month later, Safeway announced it would not rebuild. Now, five years later, there's a gym there and there's some other stores. But some neighbors say it's become a bit of a food desert in this area, and they tell us they have to go farther to get their groceries. Usually I will either walk if it's in walk, within walking distance or I'll take the bus. Uh, you know, uh, there are some grocery stores around here like Food City and there's uh, fries. Now I shop at Walmart or I have a step delivered to me. Representatives for the grocery chain didn't want to put out a public statement. There is another Safeway about five miles away. In our earlier newscast, we didn't mention that there's also an Albertson store two miles away. Albertsons and Safeway are part of the same parent company.